Hola, everybody. Uh, solar friends from different parts of the world, from Africa, Mexico, Europe, Asia, etc., etc. Before sharing uh, the screen, I would like to share with you real cooked food. Yesterday, I baked this, uh, this bread in my solar cooker. So I can eat it now or tomorrow in case it's raining day. So I can store the energy in the cooked food. In, Ju in June, last June, so uh, almost one year back, I prepared maybe 30 or 40 kgs of uh, tomato. I dry the tomato in paca cooker and also in the other cooker. So now I am eating the tomatoes that I am dried, but I am saving also them in uh, olive oil here in this jar. Uh, so if you are hungry, hungry, I can share with you some slice of the bread with uh, pumpkin jam or with the tomato. If you uh, want a cup of uh, solar tea, I have only, only one, only for me. Okay, now I am going to, to share the screen. I, I, I will share you some photos and also a video. So it is important that I activate the, the sound of the computer. Are you, are you see my screen? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Implementation mode. So, oh. uh, I'm going to to talk about the construction and use of the solar funnel pack cooker. Okay. Uh, here you can see two pack cooker installed just two meters uh, uh, distance of the door of my kitchen, okay? Uh, these uh, packet cooker are made in concrete, uh, glass mirrors, a black pot, and the two glass enclosures to make the greenhouse effect. For making the greenhouse effect around the black pot, I, uh, I am using uh, I am uh, reusing the windows of washing machine. Uh, the, uh, pieces of uh, washing machine that are not being repaired. I collect them and then I use uh, here in the, in the PACA cooker. Why the name of PACA? <laughs> When I developed, I invented this, this model after, ex, after my experience with the portable uh, uh, panel cookers, like the cook kit and also funnel cooker uh, invented by Kyung Tang, I realized that uh, for people uh, that want to cook every day, uh, it is important to have a, a, a fixed uh, solar cooker. Uh, so we don't need in this way to assemble and disassemble every every day, every time we are cooking the cooker. And the cooker should be robust. So I decide to make it in concrete. We know that the concrete is not a, a very nice product eco product, you know. Uh, but it has a very long life. So this cooker can resist uh, under the rain, under the wind. Uh, it is, we can clean it very well. So 
I had this idea not for uh, having a, a business here in my country, but uh, I, I thought uh, in this product to be local manufactured in, uh, in other countries, like in Africa, uh, in India, etc. In every place, doesn't matter if a uh, uh, kind of, of, of country. So I'm going to show you some steps uh, that we need to make this uh, paka cooker. Uh, the name of the word paka, it's a Hindi, Hindi word uh, suggested by my friend Janak, uh, Janak uh, Milligan, uh, Indian friend from indoor. Paka means robust, solid, permanent. Okay, so here you can see the three different parts of concrete. This is the the the, the base here, the the piece that goes here. Here there's an X. Here there is an an O, a cylindrical O goes there, and here the funnel that goes over this part. For each part, you need a mold, as you can see here. These molds can be produced in a different ways. When I arrived in, uh, uh, in, in Dole, in India, uh, some years ago, uh, they were finished the, uh, the first mold in, in India, following my instructions. So here you can see the different parts being uh, finished. In the same day, in the afternoon, we crossed the road to another company to, to fill the, the mold with the, 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 the cement and the sand. This uh, company in the other side of the road has the right conditions to produce this kind of uh, cooker. Here you can see the different steps of filling the different parts of the mold. Two days after the, the pieces were dried and do we, we assembled the cook, the, the different parts to have, uh, and then we, we use not uh, glass mirrors, but uh, here we are using uh, uh, the, same reflector that are usually using, used in uh, parabolic cookers, like a SK-14, like uh, uh, Prince-15. So the same, I guess, this aluminum uh, comes from, uh, or came from Germany, from Al Alanaud. So it's a very good, good quality uh, reflector. So here we have a, a very nice uh, product with a very long life. Uh, one, one year after or two years after, um, another friend in different part of India made uh, uh, another set another set of molds to make a diff, uh, another cooker in indoor. I'm talking about the mechanical engineer and artist Dival Berman. It was done manufactured at uh, Janak's Janak place in India, indoor. You can see here uh, different process or filling the and end the preparation of the, the, the cement with sand and water. And here you have uh, the different parts and then need to dry, we need to clean the mold the mold is important to clean for next time to be properly. And here you can see the final product in operation. In this case, the, the cooker is operating with uh, the Mexican pot uh, from the what, what pot, this beautiful uh, pot. Here in Portugal, I have also uh, molds. Uh, in my own that sometimes uh, I, I use to make some funnel cookers. In this case, we made this, uh, this funnel cooker and we, give, uh, we gave it uh, uh, 
to a friend and our friend made this table with these four wheels to, to move the cooker easily. So this cooker, we can track the cooker easily to the sun. We can use uh, uh, it for low sun elevations and also for high sun elevations. Uh, as you can see, it is uh, very, very, very robust. Another friend, a farmer one, a farmer uh, nearby has two packer cookers. Mm -hmm. One using glass mirrors and the other one using the, the aluminum uh, sheet of uh, good quality. So here you can see one is operating and the other one is waiting for the, the pot for cooking something. Here you can see uh, five funnel pieces with the, the mirrors and we are waiting. Uh, and uh, after certain time, we put more cement here in the border to, to have a good, a good appearance and a good finishing of, of the cooker. You can see uh, one, two, three pieces for each cooker. For example, uh, another example, uh, we gave for free to another friend in a different region of Portugal, in Alentejo, also a very good sunny area. And uh, here you can see two cookers. Now they are waiting for the, for the, the pots, but uh, you can see the sky is very cloudy. So uh, we don't have sun. So we need to wait for another day uh, for cooking. Here, you can see two other cookers uh, uh, with the, that were painted and uh, they are also waiting for the, the, the pot and the food. This is 500 kilometers north from Faro. It is in my birthplace, Figueira da Foz, close to the ocean, Atlantic Ocean. Here in my terrace, I have uh, two of them. In this case, I am operating with one. Uh, when the sun is uh, at high, uh, high elevation, okay, in, in my summer time, okay. So here I'm showing you uh, sardines to be cooked, cooked as my grandmother uh, was used to to cook in the wood oven. Here is the, the final result of the, the solar sardines. The tomatoes that I have shown you in the, at the beginning before sharing the screen are, were dried here in, in this simple way. Here you have, a, a, I don't know, remember well how to say in English, paper, I, I guess, or red paper, something like that. Now I'm showing you a, a video. I hope the, the sound has good quality. Pay attention. Now I'm going to show you how, how to bake a, a solar carob cake using carobs of my tree. I, the main ingredients are uh, carob powder, I guess, uh, more or less uh, um, five uh, spoons, five, six spoons of uh, carob powder. Uh, about uh, three spoons of sugar and about six spoons, soup, soup spoons of uh, wheat flour. We need uh, some water. Instead of butter, uh, I'm going to use uh, some olive oil, but you, you can use any other su substitute. And um, I use uh, a small spoon of um, raisin powder and also a very small amount of salt. 
these are the main ingredients for a eggless cake. I'm not uh, using this time uh, eggs, uh, so this cake will be a uh, vegan cake. But we can add other items, for example, uh, grapes and uh, or uh, pumpkin, whatever you decide to whether is possible. I will use this. Now I am going to show you. Sorry. And here, the cup, a small spoon. I am mixing all the ingredients. Uh, this kind of cake uh, should not be very, very liquid. But uh, I'm adding a little more water because we are going to use a, a cooker that is not a, a fast cooker so it's a slow cooker so we need to bake this cake it's a small one around uh, one hour and now it's it's almost 9 a.m here in faro portugal July for, uh, 14 July okay as you see is more or less well mixed now we need to prepare the the pot you are using the the pot for baking the uh, the cake if you want to, to have a cake with a hole in the middle, you can you can use a, um, um, a, um, a glass like that in inverted position. But I'm not used to do it. So, but before um, dropping the cake here, we need to put some oil. Put some oil here in the inside surface of the pot very thin one and then some wheat flour okay that's enough and now it's time to <coughs> to drop the cake one I could do three times more in this cook it will take about two hours for a big process Now for the final step, I will try to to make some decoration with the pumpkin. Now. I am going uh, to put the cake in the cooker. I don't need any protection for my hands like uh, like this or or gloves because the pot now is uh, cold. But at the end, obviously, I will need to 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 do it to protect the end. It's very important. So the the cake goes here to the cooking zone. We have one glass below and the other glass 
that's for washing machine old washing machine yeah so now it's 9 a.m the sun is there so i need to rotate like this okay not very high position the sun but uh, in two hours the sun rotates there and uh, it will be more high and i will need to do like that but only after two hours if i need to continue cook something to cook something in the in the cooker but for now i just to to put the cooker in this position and i can go to do other things for example today is sunday i can go to the to the church thank you baking process is going on you can see condensation inside so the water vapor scapping from the cake will contact the, the glass that is colder than the dew point of the atmosphere inside uh, so there is condensation and I guess this cake is almost ready but I need to go to go out my home so I'll come back in one hour and then I will see I will not I'm not going to adjust the the cooker because in that in that way because it's clear sky the cake will become completely burnt so the the cooker will remain in this position position when sun is low okay see you next step i have started baking the cut off cake at uh, 9 a.m uh, now is uh, 11 30 am uh, as you can see the, the cooker was not adjusted it, uh, it is uh, in this in at the initial position if uh, i wanted to to start an, baking uh, a, new, a new cake i should uh, do like that i need to adjust way the cooker the packer cooker and then because the the the, the sun is in a very high position i need to do it like this uh, you can come here to see in more detail the the cake is ready uh, it is not very very hot now because the, the cooker was switched off automatically after 10, 10 something am and uh, because I am using a transparent lid I can see that uh, the, the cake is is ready and like that Come to the table. part I, I turn it like this it's hot you need to wait some minutes I remember that is a eggless cake so complete vegan cake I can just try a little little piece mm, very good Okay, so I hope you have enjoyed the, the video. Um, so I am finishing uh, my presentation. Um, I, I, before my presentation, I 
I have uh, uploaded two PDFs to the chat about uh, with uh, two files. Uh, one file is uh, about uh, the construction of the, the Paca cooker and the molds. And uh, the other file is about uh, basic instructions how to make uh, a portable funnel cooker. Uh, Michael mentioned the, the console food that we are planning for January 2022. So if you are, uh, you are invited to, to participate and to submit uh, an abstract, please do, do it. Thank you to the organizers to invite me to participate uh, and to share my, my experience using uh, the, the packer cooker. Thank you. Okay, uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.